Level 50 fucking one before I knew that. Yeah. I followed it with. <laughs> I followed it before it was even a mission. I got to mission now, I was stuck on <coughs> I just saw it and fucking followed it. Yeah, drink it. What's that dude with bomb doing, dude? <laughs> Dear bastards again. He's behind you, Nath. He's at here. Is it B, Nathan? Don't listen to him. Nice one, Nathan. It's that actually not Nathan. Nathan. Nathan's not this good. Well, Phil. <laughs> yeah, get your own account, Ashley. <laughs> Need to get myself an Xbox One first. I got Xbox 360 last Christmas and everywhere but everybody else got a fucking Xbox One. You got an Xbox 360 last Christmas? Yeah, because I brought me other one. <laughs> oh, but, bullshit. But last Christmas the Xbox One had already been out for a full year. Well... <laughs> I didn't play, it wasn't good enough boys to get off centre. <laughs> So you got an Xbox 360 last year after it had already been out nine years. I've had about six of them. Great some old time. <coughs> Destroy your Xbox stash. Well, if they don't do us what they're meant to do, they're gonna get away. <laughs> it gets a punch. Yeah. <laughs> I have one Xbox. No, I fucking fell off my power. The fuck did it disconnect? Planting on B. I'm dead. I fell off now. You're crapping, aren't you? The wall running, the wall running didn't wall run. Oh, well, that is bullshit. He I connected to wall and it, I put, it jumped two steps and then dead. It fell off. What is this guy doing? He knows where he is, he's just seen him. He's wasted time. As if he'd come back. <laughs> Uh, no, I fell off map. I died. I killed myself. Hardy's an 82 on B for an old dick. Is it? Yeah, they put it to, they do that special black card. He's an 82. There's a blue one with him and all that. I won't be on tonight. Yeah, Ashley. What? 
We end up carrying too much, fuck's oh, sake. Right, well, that game's over. Uh, I think we're going to have to go Why are you not... I equipped you with darts, so I'll fucking use it. Playing a bit of yeah. Yeah, man. <clears throat> Come on. Just built me, uh, <clears throat> built me fucking teleportation device. Where I am now. Who are you doing it with? Myself. Oh, you should do it with River Rod. <laughs> the little camping bit. Railroad's only one that's going to make sure they stay alive, otherwise all going to get battered. I'm doing it. With, I'm doing it with railroad at the moment, but I've made a save file so then I, I can do it with the others as well. Sad I've added ass. that. Do it with brother. Oh my god. A response would be appreciated. You know that big fucking giant robot what you have in Fallout 3 from brother. Yeah. Amish, you need to get some kills, you man. You don't want to feed, bro. I know, I'm fucking have had two hit marks in a row. Fucking one shot dead gun there. Fucking hit marker. The response would be appreciated. Yeah, no hit marker hey, there. You got one? There's a man. None of that. That last two games, that's been a hit marker on that dude. Since escape to Freedom's dozens of synths owe him their lives. We don't know his name, we've never had a way to contact him, so we gave him the code name, Patriot. If your plan works, and you are able to get to Freedom, we need you to make contact. How can I contact him if you know nothing about him? Patriot devised a method to communicate with us one way. The plan hinges on us using this method to close the loop and contact him back. That guy's just run off. Okay. I'll do my best. Palms encrypted a message for Patriot's eyes only. Once he sees it, he'll contact you. Until you I ain't got a clue where this guy is. Yeah, I do. After. Oh, man, tell me you You fucking can't. I was just aimed on him, literally, with sniper. Can you do that? Can you I were aimed on him. On the inside? I do just died to the left. You can do this. I believe I'm just down to the right. Stand on the platform and I'll give you the hug. <laughs> <laughs> just plug it into any institute terminal. Oh, you motherfucker. I just had my rejack and all. Like, even if you it's a shame why haven't I got enough fucking kills over on one to three. Now I'm on three to three. You still whinge. Weaknesses. 
If we can disable or destroy the Institute, we may have to do it. You jack that holocaust into any time, and Patriot will make contact. He has to. So I use any terminal, I use this terminal and then it don't work. I think I've been kicked out. Aha! Uh -huh. Because it loaded up <laughs> and then I got a black loading screen. Yeah. Timed out. Oh, I think I've been kicked out. What do you think of us? I'd like to show you that you're. That was a very good map and I got kicked out altogether. <laughs> Have you been to Institute, Rob? Countless experiments yeah. and trials. A shared vision of how science can help shape the future. It has never been easy. And our actions are often misinterpreted by those above ground. Someday, perhaps, we can show them what we've accomplished. But for now, we must remain underground. There's too much at stake here to risk it all. As you've seen, things above are unstable. I'd like to talk to you about what we can do for anyone. But that can wait. You are here for a specific, very personal reason. You are here for your son. Sean. Sean. Oh my god. It's really you. Who are you? Sean. It's me. I'm... I'm your dad. Father! What's going on? What's happening? Fascinating, disappointing. 
The child's responses were not at all correct. It's just, he's a prototype, you understand. We're only just now beginning to explore the effects of extreme emotional stimuli. Please try and keep an open mind. I recognize that you are emotional and that your journey here has been fraught with challenges. Let's start anew. I am fond of you. Welcome to the Institute. Give me Sean. The real Sean. Right now! I know. I know. You've gone to such lengths to find him. He's here, in the Institute, closer than you think. But I need you to realize that this situation is far more complicated than you could imagine. You have traveled very far and suffered a great deal to find your son. His father! How much have you done in the Institute, Rob? Have you done it all and then got back out? It's good to finally... Uh, I've not done any in it. Yo, Thomas, you're still here. I am sure. Yeah. I am. Last thing I've done is set up the uh, that teleport up. Teleport down. Send it off after the teleport up. How is that even possible? I know this is a lot to take in. Can't say one zombies then, Tom. You had no chance uh, after yeah, the passage of time. You were released from your pod and oh, went fine. searching for the sun. You've lost. But then you learn that your son What's this was nightmare near for? But a ten year old boy. It's shit. You believe it's humans and zombies. It's weird. Is it really so hard to accept that it was not ten, but sixty years? That is the real humans and zombies. And here I am. Yeah. Raised by Sounds the quite good. Two, and now it's lethal. You be people shooting at you and the zombies. What now? But why? And there's a mystery box where you can collect unlimited why? fucking shit from. I know. Why I know. Say if you get five ah, million. Now that's the question, isn't it? In coins. Why? Five million. Five. You must get five million coins in a safe for six months. The institute. Bit of Bro, how much do you think that gold's gonna be? At end of calendar. Scientific. Oh, I'd say about hundred, two hundred. All of perfection drove them ever on. What they want. I think and, uh, be more than that. Be, be yeah, but that first one, number two calendar, that one. The human being, walking, talking, fully articulate, capable of anything. So the weird science experiments needed specimens. That's why they took you. In a manner of speaking. The Institute endeavored to create synthetic organics. The most logical starting point, of course, was human DNA. Plenty of that was available, of course, but it had all become corrupted. In this wasteland, radiation affected everyone. Even in their attempts to shield themselves from the world above, members of the Institute had been exposed Another source was necessary, but then the Institute found me after discovering records from Vault 111. An infant, frozen in time, protected from the radiation-induced mutations that had crept into every other human cell in the Commonwealth. I was exactly what they needed. And so it was my DNA that became the basis of the synthetic organics used to create every human-like synth you see today. I am their father. Through science, we are family. The synths, me, and you. Sean. It's really you doing, Nick? You alright? I'm alright, you? I know you must yeah, not bad. You sound a lot better. <laughs> yeah, I am. Still a little bit croaky every now and again, though. Well, you sound a hundred times better than last week. <laughs> Come on. So you're still plugging away at Fallout? Yeah, I feel 
I feel the end is in sight. <laughs> really? Yeah, I don't think I'm not. F <sighs> well, story wise, yeah. Yes. Fair enough. Would you have preferred that I turned him loose on the Commonwealth? Well, I managed to complete Tomb Raider. <laughs> well done. Eventually. The Institute took advantage of Kellogg's vicious nature. I will freely admit that. Institute technology prolonged his life and his Um, I had a look at your games on PlayStation the other day, so I see that you maxed out Uncharted 1 and 2. You never played three. I won't lie. Should be on there. What is it? Yeah. Uh, I never completed three, uh, but I definitely played three. Okay. Well, you just did the story once. What else can I say? What do you mean? Uh, well, I never even completed the main story. Oh, okay. You tried three. Uh, I got about halfway through. The thing is, I made a mistake of playing all those games back to back, pretty much. Do you know what I mean? And after a while, you. You yeah. start to get bored, don't you? Yeah. What happened to her was... Um, but I can't praise those games enough. They're really, really good. Especially the she second one. The second one's fucking important. brilliant. Yeah. That's what I've heard. Even my uh, PlayStation friends are like, oh, yeah. Um, obviously, number two is the best. Yeah, number two is the one, man. Uh, num the first one's really good, um, but it's going to be a bit bare bones. Like, you're playing, you know, it's quite basic. Um, but it still looks pretty, and, you know, it's a good game. Um, the the second one, that's when things get really cool. Yeah, the, the, they've done a, the first one, they've updated the graphics, right? The first one gets on my nerves a, a bit sometimes when I'm, uh, you know, jumping a climb, and it's like, if you nick the wall, you don't jump far enough for... It, it jumps the wrong direction if it's just a little off. It's like, oh, come on. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, I just can't remember. I remember I remember a sub uh, submarine just sort of sitting in a waterfall area yeah. right at the beginning of the game. And it, I remember being really wowed by that. I thought, Whoa. Back then, that was like one of the best looking things you'll see. I spent decades working to this point. It's a responsibility. Yeah, for I've made a save for this, so then I can I go back and do the other factions. This is missable, missable achievements. If you don't save it at the right time, and that you've got to do the game three times. Or the main story. Yeah, or the main story anyway. Yeah, you don't want to be doing that, especially for a game of that size. There, to say the least. No, we've tried that. The Institute once tried to help create a stabilized Commonwealth government. It ended in bickering, infighting. It was a disaster. No. So yeah, I've got the thousand on uh, Tomb Raider now. I did all the uh, speed the runs, like time school stuff. Did really good on some of them. I'm like, I was 34 in the wellness on one level, uh, 28 oh. on another. Really quick. I was like, and the score, I had to get like, you had to keep the multiplayer up, and I was kicking ass. I was like, wow. The Institute is on the verge of some important breakthroughs. Your presence. Um, so, yeah, I've done that. The DLC's come out for it, so it says I haven't completed it because it's got another 250G there, but that doesn't, you can't get that yet until they release the DLC. I won't probably won't buy it straight away anyway. Or so many other games. I managed to get one of the hardest achievements on there, Battlefront as well. I looked on TA, only like 300 people have got it. So I was like, yep. Maybe. I don't know. This is so much to take in. I know. And I am sorry. You have been through so much in such a short time. The Institute can provide. So I was looking at games. So I've, my birthday's on a Sunday. Yeah. And I was thinking, right, what do I. What do I ask for? Because, you know, I've pretty much bought everything I wanted. I said to my mum. She's like, what do you want for your birthday? I thought I'd better ask her, tell her something, or she'll give me something I don't really want. I've seen it myself. I thought, uh, well, you can give me Assassin's Creed. I haven't that played one since <laughs> Revelations, so I thought, well, that's long enough for me to 
Okay, an Assassin's Creed. So I'm going to get Syndicate. And I'm thinking, now do I get... Do I get Fallout, or do I get Rainbow Six? A chance to show you what I for longer to fall out. Fallout really do have humanity's best interest. Fallout 4. Yeah. I mean, I'm getting uh, <coughs> I'm getting Rainbow Six for Christmas off my mum. Um, yeah. And I mean, Dan and uh, one of my other friends said that they were getting it. I just never see them on anymore. I'm not on at the, you know, like at the same time as they are anymore. It's like he's right. he's got a new job, so he's working all week. Uh, obviously, I work weekends, and then by the time I come on at night time, when our lass is at sleep, like half eight, nine o'clock, he's gone off. Or yeah, so we're just not on at the same time anyway. So, but yeah, for long activity, I'd go for Fallout. Um, and finally, Dr. Lee but I don't know who else on your friends list might have or he's going to get Siege. And then we'll I don't know. <laughs> I don't think anyone is. This is it. I think you're the only one I know of that's buying it or getting it. Yeah. I mean, um...